Why does Bob get all the toys? <laughs> <laughs> Unreal game uh, engine. Oh, it's an unreal expectation to give Bob all the toys. Bob the Builder can't <laughs> Under, see, never watched the show, but great, great uh, opening song. Mm. Bob the yes. Builder Yes, classic opening song. Dora, 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 the Explorer. <laughs> Dora, Dora. Speaking of Dora, we have is infamous too. Spiral, spiral, spiral. Yeah, the destroyer. Yes, the destroyer. Both of our characters. Yes. Also, welcome everybody. We're playing more Spyro. Um, hopefully, the camera won't be like a little, 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 make you want to barf this time because I have a different setup. Um, but anyway, I was saying that both Hollow Knight and Spyro are just kind of like destroying everything in their path. Whoa. Did you see that? He ate it? No, no. The sheep was just like, uh, without any fur. Yeah. And he was just like, oh. And then he just vanished. So now, maybe I'm not have maybe you I'm seen... not killing them. Maybe they're just disappearing somewhere safe to safe sheep heaven land. Which I support. You know, when you shave a sheep, they shear them mm -hmm. with these shearing clippers. And the shearing clippers are very smooth. Mm. Sheep, what? They produce wool, right? I think so. Or cotton, which is made out well, of wool. I thought cotton. I thought cotton came from plants. Oh, Kids. it does. So, so wool. Is it wool? Yes. So wool is yeah, sheep. Wool. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. And the clippers they use are very like big. Really? Have we seen that wizard before? Yeah, there we've been come. here before, and we flew over there, and I think that's where we ended the episode. Did we fly? Did we fly? We did home? fly. We glided. Oh, we, gl we glided. There so we I go. need to remember what... Okay, it's the, this button. Okay. And you know, you know what's super special about that first episode? Because Spyro was the first episode we ever recorded together. Um, yes, it was. I mean, test episode all of it it was the first time ever um playing a game and talking Special about it place in my heart. and you know what that video was the 100th video on the channel yeah i thought that was like so epic like what are the chances that the timing works out perfectly for it to be well, this is the hundredth for you or you mark the 100th video on the 100th on the channel I just thought that was super cool. Okay, that that goes to tell you that something divine is mm. is, a, is a foot. Mm -hmm. Amen. <laughs> we, we got to put a label on it, but something divine may be a foot. Yes, yes. I agree. Very special. See, the one thing I do like about Hollow Knights is it's more interactive, where you can touch on more, you can jump on more stuff. Whereas Spiral, yeah, certain things you can't jump on top of, and I hate that about like these. Yes. Yeah, I think nowadays the more expensive games they do a lot better. They do a way better job in detailing everything, mm -hmm. making but everything more because interactive. Because they're so big, yeah, like be able to jump on more stuff, like run into things. Ooh, he's fast, though. You gonna catch him? You don't think? Ooh, just jumping, yeah, jumping is slow. Maybe I, oh yeah, maybe I do have to glide. I don't know if I can catch him. Oh, I do have to glide. You're so smart. Oh. oh, not that way, Carl. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because this is an older Ew. this is an older game that they remastered. So older games weren't all about. Oh, ouch! They they weren't all about punch. being able to touch and interact with everything like games are now. I feel like. Yeah, I agree. Boy, I'm trying to find dragons, but I don't see any dragons. What was that? It was a show or a movie where he was like, I can't fly, but I can glide. And you're like, you're flying. Oh. Oh, I, I know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about, though. You know what I mean? Yes and yes. <laughs> I That sounds familiar, but I don't... I can't quite... Oh, there's a dragon. Another handsome boy. 
Oh, nope, that was a tree. Okay. Big open area. What is it? Oh. I'm so annoyed now that I, I want to know. Ouch. Oh, Ouch. Who, who, what was that? Oh, that's a... Uh... It's a force field. What's force Some field? eternal monarch. Or... Uh, what's the other one? There's another K-drama that has an invisible force field. What is it called? Abyss? Uh, uh, I don't know. Oh well. Dun, 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 dun. I can't find the dragon because I'm a little dumb boy. I'm a little dumb boy. I can't find the dragon game. Dang, this is gonna annoy me because what was that scene where he was like, I can't fly, but he's gliding. I'm flying, I'm flying. There was something like that. It's not How to Train Your Dragon, which is like stuck in my head of like, my brain's like, is it this? That was a good movie called. That was a good movie. The first was one was good really movie. good. They overdid it, but was yep. really good. They always overdo it. Let's see what's the top 10 new top. Okay. Oh, is this different? Nope. I'm just going in circles, so I guess I'll just... I guess this is all I can do in this area, so I'll just go back. Oh. Oh, that's cool. I can make the camera stay. Oh, okay. Okay. Ooh, I haven't been in here. Dun, 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 dun. I don't know what I don't know what that movie is. It's on. It's right there. Yeah, I'll blame you, Carl. I'll blame you. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm just like it's I've got my there. mental telepathy blocker up, and I just you know I don't feel like taking it down. <laughs> okay. What are you saying, handsome oh, dragon? Oh, all dragons found. Cool. We found them all? <laughs> Thank you, fairy. You gave me a little dink. Yeah, it said all dragons found. So I guess we go back to that guy in the blimp. Maybe. I keep I keep wanting to taco because we just got the taco in Hollow Knight. And uh, actually, that might be spoilers depending on how I release this. So I didn't say anything. We just got the taco in Hollow Knight. Taco. So have you seen Zootopia? Oh my gosh. Zootopia is my top three favorite movies of all time. Yes. Do you want to know... Do you relate to the fox a lot? No. But, well... Mm. Uh, maybe to his personality? But, so... Yes. <laughs> I guess my answer is yes, after some thought. Why? What is your... Why? Why? Just ask. Okay. Right. Just ask. Okay. No judgment. Sure. Zero judgment, you all. Okay. I'm not saying Cole is a sly fox. Hmm. Who manipulates people, who steals, hey. any <laughs> of that stuff. Whoa, whoa. I'm not Hold saying on. that. That's not what you're saying, but I'm it is what you're saying. How dare Say, you? You put Cole relates you, to a character. You put this on the internet where people are like, "Oh, we don't know how Cole is behind the behind the scenes." And Peter does, so he must be right. Cole was Cole's a butt in real life. Well, as you can hear, Cole is really frantic right now. I'm not sure if he's <laughs> trying to cover up who he really is. You know, I, I shouldn't care what people think of me on the internet. I, I'm. He taught me taught me a, a Jason valuable Bateman lesson. Jason Bateman plays the fox. Yes, Jason Bateman is amazing. I love Jason Bateman. Why do people like Jason Bateman so much? Because his voice, his voice has this timbre to it that is just. I like oh. Jason Bateman. Too. You do? I like Jason Bateman. Oh, okay, good. I hate that I like though. I hate that I do. <laughs> I really do. I hate that I do. I just Why? What's the problem? Why you gotta love hate with Jason Bateman? It's three people I do not like in this world. Okay. It's. Uh, Kevin Gates, Jason Bateman, mm -hmm. and uh, who else? It's one more person. I forgot. If, if y'all bring them up, I remember. But them two for sure, I did not like. It's not because they did anything. Uh huh. Nothing they did wrong. Yeah. But things that other people have said about them that I was like, you like them too much. I don't like them. <laughs> mm. And I don't like that. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> When too many people like it, you're like, I don't like it. That's how I felt well, about... Well, one particular person that said they liked them. And I didn't oh, like just one person. 
Yeah. It, it's from my past too. I have any relationship with this person no more. I don't like this person. No. Like oh that. well, but you know that makes that makes sense. When they said that, I was like, and the way they said it, it was like, I love Kevin Case. I love. Oh, I just love Jason Baby. I said you do. Like oh. I, I don't like too much. don't play his music when I'm around. Yeah. And I like Jason Bateman. Yeah. Like I am a big like I don't know who I didn't know who Jason Bateman was until she said his name. And I've seen so many of Jason Bateman movies. Wiggle, wiggle, okay. Wiggle, 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 uh, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. What movie was that he was in? Uh Horrible Bosses. Loved it. Oh yeah? I haven't seen it. Freaking loved it. I'll have to. Identity Thief Ooh. loved it. Uh Ooh. Dodgeball. This music. Oh, I love it. Whoa. Hancock. He was in a few movies I really like. Okay. Yeah. There's a Hancock too? Uh I don't know, is there? Wow. There's so many movies I haven't seen. I feel very uncultured. Ooh, he's got shield. Can I ram? Oh, that's that's not what I want. Okay. Ram. There we go. Yeah. Oh. Alright. Just had to fire. Square. Got it. Now, Ooh, I want to light the fire. Why do you like the fox so much? Because he, like, ch changed over a new leaf. Well, and, so... You know, no. Stop tricking people and using people. No, it's just his, just his way of talking and his way of joking. And um, when I watched Utopia, I just loved it so much that I, I looked up all the behind the scenes. And I ended up learning... Oops fire for him. I ended up learning a ton about foxes. And I learned that in the animation they learned that foxes like think and react at the same time. They're very quick. And so like their ears are moving while they're thinking about something else. And they use that to inspire the animation of Nick Wilde. And I was like, whoa. And I just got really into foxes. Foxes are my favorite animals. If you come to my house, everything I own is fox related. Um, and uh, so it just kind of became this whole new thing and I also just liked how Zootopia talked about um, I guess it was about race but I, I'd like to extend it just to uh, about bias in general Ow. and I just thought it was a cool movie you know so uh, yeah I kind of went on a whole Zootopia rant there um, clearly I'm obsessed <laughs> but yeah did that answer your question <laughs> it, it did one second confirmed Cole is has a painful past that he's <sighs> stuffing down so I oh because I'm, I'm going to make a few statements not statements but a few you know uh -huh. it's a few things in the courtroom of uh, of of Fox versus uh, Cole Everything I said about Cole not being the stuff, it was 100% uh, uh, true. Cole is all the stuff I said he wasn't. <laughs> uh, I did not know he liked foxes. Did never knew fox was his his go-to animal. Yeah, absolutely. But what I will say in that same vein, we was talking about how, how Zootopia did this this uh, carnivores versus mm -hmm. omnivores. Yeah, or, predators, uh, carnivores predators versus, versus prey. Uh, Predator versus Prey. I wasn't sure, but Zootopia came out. I did not know something else came out as well. Mm -hmm. And this is called B Stars. V Stars. And B Stars. B Stars. Yeah, B Stars. Ow. Yep. Uh, B A S T A R S. B Stars. Got it. Yeah. Oh. And. So we get to me stop saying and like so slow and stuff. But in B Stars, the whole premise is the same as Utopia, <laughs> but it takes place in more of a high school setting mm -hmm. and it falls around the same, oh. you know, like this time it's a wolf uh -huh. and not a fox. Mm -hmm. And you know, when you look at them animated, they really close similarly because they both got those ears, long nose, oh, so long noses. So and it's stuff still like that. animals, but it's in a high school setting. Cole, it's still animals. Okay. Got it. <laughs> the, the female lead is a bunny. Oh ho. Cold. Yep. Seeing bunny themes. Somebody really likes bunnies. Uh, like, a bunny. I, no, Cole. This is B Stars. It's not, it's not Disney. for kids, though. 
Oh, okay. Not for kids. Uh, oh. No, no, not for kids. Adult bunny. It, it came out in 2014. Oh, got it. So, this came out in 2014. When did Zootopia come out? Zootopia was like 2017, I think. 2016, yeah. Oh, 2016. 2016. But it, it probably it, it probably was a development for like two, three years. Like, there's no Disney. Yeah. So, I'm not saying whichever one came first. They probably came out at the same time. And if that's the case, that's even scarier. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because if both of them star a fox and a bunny or a wolf and a bunny, uh huh. Beastars is also on Netflix. You should watch it. And if you watch it, you might be in love with it because it's, it's the same premise but on a deeper, more Ooh. realistic type of uh, type of uh, vibe. Ah, so I love just it. Just be aware of that. Yeah. Beastars is really, really good. Really, really good. Really, really oh, good. Man. Like, like, so you say your top three movies. Mm hmm. What's what's your other two? You know, we'll find out next time because this video is over. So oh, it's been fifteen minutes. It has been, yeah. Yeah, we gotta make a note of that to remind us of fifteen, like your top three movies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll do so it we right when we out, get back. We have to find out next episode of uh, yes. uh, uh, as we told me, of uh, what's your Spyro. Topic. Next episode of Spyro. My top three favorite movies. How exciting. Don't mess with my computer. <laughs> <laughs>